Women's marches were held today in all 50 states, including one right here in downtown Portland. Fox 12's Bridget Chavez spoke with the organizer and participants. This is just one of many women's marches being held all across the country today. The organizer here tells me they're here to make sure that women's voices are heard and to support the Black Lives Matter movement. This is what you call a revolution. Hundreds of people filled Terry Shrunk Plaza in downtown Portland for the Women's March. Many say their kids are the reason they're here. And I think it's important for me more than ever to show my daughter that her rights are just as important as my son's rights and as important as my husband's rights. Um, and just to be a good role model for her and take the time and the energy to be here and to speak up. Jean Gray and Leah Gordon are mothers. Both say it's important that they lead by example and show their children how to use their voices for change. It's a mom and a, a health care provider and I'm a concerned citizen. I feel like if we don't show up and use our voices, then we'll lose them. Rose Lawrence organized the march. She says it comes down to just two things. Right now the goal is no, inaug or no confirmation until inauguration and dump Trump, please. <laughs> Lawrence says she's happy with the large turnout so that more people can be heard. The people that I have speaking, which to me are really important members of our community, BIPOC members, get a really amazing platform to have people hear what they need to say. Which in this time I think is really important, especially like the election and all that. Like We need to amplify some voices right now to make change. There were nine other protests like this held around Oregon today. Reporting from downtown, Bridget Chavez, Fox 12, Oregon.